Last week, along with Billy Kelleher, my colleague, I travelled to Israel and to Palestine and to the West Bank to see for ourselves at first hand the experiences in Israel and in Palestine. We have been subject to a lot of uh, communication from members of the public, from NGOs and from interest groups in relation to the whole Middle East peace process. So we decided to go there ourselves to see the situation on the ground. When we were there we met with uh, Mr Isaac Herzog who is the leader of the opposition in the Israeli parliament, the Knesset. We met with officials from the American embassy and we met with a number of officials from uh, the Israeli Foreign Department, in particular uh, their European Affairs Division. And we discussed with them uh, the happenings of the Middle East peace process, uh, where it is going and the imminent um, initiative which is expected from the Trump administration from the United States. The second day of our tour we visited the West Bank, we visited Ramallah, Hebron and a number of the occupied territories. And when we went to the occupied territories, uh, we were shown around at first hand by um, Al Haq, which is an NGO working on the ground, and Susan Power, who works for them. And we've had a number, we captured a number of our experiences of the occupied territories on video, which uh, are part of this package. Uh, it was very, very compelling and left a very, very strong impression on me and indeed on my colleague, uh, Deputy Billy Kelleher. That was in Ramallah and along the West Bank. We went into the Jordan Valley where we saw the impact of the um, occupation of, his, of Palestinian lands by the Israelis. We also, in the afternoon, later in the day, we went to visit Hebron. Uh, this was um, organised by a group known as Breaking the Silence and they took us on their tour. Uh, this group is uh, made up of former Israeli uh, elite um, military personnel who have uh, a point of view that is very sympathetic to the Palestinian cause and certainly when we were in Hebron uh, again we saw on the ground at first hands the, the impact and the effect of um, Israeli occupation of Palestinian lands. Um, yesterday evening the Fianna Fáil Parliamentary Party um, got a report from myself and from my colleague Deputy Billy Kelleher on foot of our return from uh, the Middle East, from Israel and Palestine and the decision was taken, uh, overwhelming decision was taken really uh, to support uh, the uh, Control of Economic Activity Occupy Territories Bill which is before the Shannad uh, next week. Uh, this bill basically seeks to uh, ban the trade in goods and services which originate from occupied territories anywhere in the world. And um, it was discussed at length at our front bench and the front bench made a recommendation to our parliamentary party to support the bill which is coming up on Wednesday of next week. Uh, the sponsor of the bill is independent Senator Francis Black.